There is something new in the friendly city of Pampa, where they say, hang your hat on the top of Texas, where wheat grows and oil flows. Since its beginning in 1884, when the Santa Fe laid the first rails to the spot, Pampa has prospered and grown with its cattle, wheat, oil, and gas industries. Its population has now reached 20,000. A glance at Pampa's industry will show that manufacturing there is based on natural resources and raw materials available in the northern panhandle of Texas. The city, with its schools, churches, parks, retail and service stores and businesses, is headquarters for the majority of the oil and gas companies operating in the region. Major companies with plants in or near this center of the northern panhandle region of Texas include Caber Carbon Company, Salonese Corporation, City Service Corporation, Phillips Petroleum Company, and Columbian Carbon Company. The city of Pampa has installed in its downtown business district the Dempster Dumpster System, the most modern and lowest cost method for storage and collection of bulk trash and rubbish. Already known as one of the world's cleanest oil towns, Pampa may now lay claim to an even higher position among the cleaner cities throughout the nation. At Pampa, the Dempster Dumpster System comprises one truck-mounted Dempster Dumpster operated by only one man, the driver, and 33 Dempster Dumpster detachable containers ranging in capacity from 8 to 12 cubic yards. The containers are located at convenient accumulation points such as downtown alleys. These big, specially designed containers help Pampa prevent fires and disease. They eliminate costly re-handling of waste materials. They eliminate scattering of rubbish by winds and scavengers. By means of hydraulic controls in the cab, the driver picks up, hauls and dumps one preloaded container after another. Note that the truck-mounted Dempster Dumpster with the container in carrying position moves with the same ease and speed as any conventional truck. Emptying a container is a natural, continuous operation, controlled hydraulically by the driver inside the cab. Note that the drop bottom section of the container, as shown by this universal type, permits complete and clean discharge of all contents. The Dempster Dumpster system replaced in Pampa a conventional, inefficient, unsanitary method that required a crew of three men, each 48 hours per week. Now the same areas are being serviced by only one truck-mounted Dempster Dumpster and one man, the driver. Initial investment for the equipment in the Dempster Dumpster system may be amortized by the city of Pampa by labor savings alone in approximately four years. Now let's look at some of the conditions in Pampa before and after the Dempster Dumpster system was installed. Here's how trash and rubbish were collected behind a department store. Note the cleanliness after one Dempster dumpster container replaced an adequate, unsanitary, conventional method. Here's another before scene between a clothing and a department store. It's another typical condition that might be found in most any city. Such conditions are, of course, unnecessary today. They can be easily corrected with the Dempster dumpster system at tremendous savings. Needless to say, this modern method has more than improved the condition, it has completely corrected it. Before Pampa eliminated this bad condition in back of a cafe, 
garbage was exposed to flies and rodents and blown and scattered in the alleys and streets. Now the refuse is kept where it belongs, out of sight. Here's a scene before and after a container was installed at a menswear store. This is what the camera saw at an office building before and after a Dempster dumpster container was installed. Here is how trash and rubbish were collected from both a cafe and a garage before a Dempster dumpster container was installed. Note again how completely the container eliminates the inadequate unsanitary condition. Like a river that always flows, trash and rubbish accumulation never ends. It is one of the constant problems that every city faces, not only in good housekeeping, but because of vital sanitation protection. Conventional collection like this at the rear of a drugstore in Pampa was not only unsanitary, but was costly for the city, requiring crews to rehandle the materials. With the Dempster dumpster system, waste materials are now deposited in the big containers and never again touched by human hands. Also, note that one container becomes a single depository for several business establishments, eliminating several scattered collection points. Here we have waste materials being deposited in a container that not only eliminated the bad condition behind the drugstore, but also eliminated a similar condition behind a motor company. The same container used by the drugstore is also used by the motor company. Wherever this amazing system is installed, businessmen willingly testify to its remarkable improvement in good housekeeping, efficiency, and economy. Note the typically unsanitary refuse houses behind this food store before the new container was installed. Now look behind this same food store. What a transformation after the Dempster dumpster system was put in use. This 12 cubic yard container has just been taken to the dump, emptied, and is now being returned to its station. Notice that the only manual operation required in placing a container is detaching the lifting chain from each side. The driver then returns to the cab and pulls away to serve another preloaded container. Since its installation, the city officials have had nothing but praise for the Dempster dumpster system. They have this to say. Except for water and sewerage projects, the Dempster dumpster system is the best investment ever made by the city of Pampa. 
Here, Commissioner Neal, City Manager Fred Brook, and Sanitation Superintendent Bush Haggard inspect one of their containers. Mr. Brook is showing Mr. Neal a safety handle he designed for inside one door of each container being used in Pampa's downtown business district. At this big food store, these three city employees each averaged 40 minutes every day under the old method of trash collection. Refuse stored in a room inside the building had to be rehandled daily. All this time spent in rehandling of trash has now been eliminated by the Dempster dumpster system. 120 man minutes or two man hours were spent at this master food store by city paid personnel each day under the old method. Today, with Pampa's new system, one employee, the driver, picks up, hauls, and empties a day's accumulation in only 25 minutes. In addition, this store was able to discontinue accumulating rubbish in the rear end of the store, a dangerous fire hazard, and an unsanitary breeding place for flies and rats. Tampa is a typical demonstration of what is happening throughout the nation in city after city. Wherever you turn, the problem is the same. Rubbish and more rubbish. The question, what to do with it, is being answered at tremendous savings and amazing improvements in sanitation with the one and only Dempster Dumpster System. Be they department stores, cafes, drug stores, hospitals, schools, or apartments, the result is always the same, complete satisfaction. The alleys in Pampa are only 20 feet wide. In many cities where the Dempster Dumpster system is in operation, some alleys are even narrower. But regardless of width of alleys, containers equipped with casters are handled with ease and with no loss of time. Such a container is quickly rolled in and out of places where no truck could enter. Although a container with casters is usually recommended for such a case, this driver uses a unique maneuver to handle a container without casters in a narrow alley. When this picture was made, he had been operating the truck-mounted Dempster Dumpster for only three days. This scene illustrates how simple the equipment is to operate and how rapidly your driver will master its operation. The containers are constructed with quarter-inch rolled steel and are built for years and years of service. They provide protective storage of bulk refuse, eliminate rehandling of materials, eliminate fire hazards, eliminate rodents and the scattering of trash by winds and scavengers. In cities smaller than Pampa, right on up to the city of New York, the Dempster Dumpster System has solved the two problems of bulk rubbish handling, unsanitary storage conditions, and costly collection. The Dempster Dumpster System eliminates unsanitary storage conditions and cuts the collection cost tremendously.
you too can hang your hat on the Dempster dumpster system, the modern, efficient and sanitary method of bulk rubbish collection.